brush. What's down in there? Anything? To my right, by the stump, are Okapi. Okapi may look similar to zebra, but they're actually a relative oh, of the giraffe. See. To my left, atop the hill, those antelope are greater kudu. They are the second largest antelope in Africa. Adult males can weigh up to 750 pounds. Wow. Yeah, those are real. If you think those ears are big, wait till you see ones with horns. I can spot some pink pack pelicans in the, along the river's edge. Pink pack pelicans live in trees and colonies and will often herd fish together in the shallow waterway. What do you think, Jake? To my right, atop the hill, are yellow billed storks. Yellow billed storks eat fish, frogs, snakes, and even little birds. Now, occasionally in this area, we may see black rhino. There's a black rhino right in front of us. A black rhino may seem indestructible, but tragically, they've been hit hard by poaching. There are less than 4,000 black rhino left in the world. Those of you on my left can look down to see how to kitty fowl. They are the most common the rhino, found bird in Africa. That's a black rhino atop the hill. You see that rhino, Jack? Yeah. Yep. These real rhinos. Hey, Jake, look over here. Oh, there's something over there. Coming up to my right are bongo. Bongo, bongo. are so bongo. rarely seen in the wild that they are called hey, ghosts of the forest. Wow. wow, look. To my left, atop the hill, are saddle-built stalks, the tallest stalks in Africa. They can stand at five feet with a wingspan of eight to nine feet long. We're going over water again. Okay, Mike, that's because I'm Hey, I know that voice. Symbol one. Kong Warden Wilson Matua. How are you making the rounds today? Over. Yes, Symbol one. And today I have a passenger. Miss Jobson, my favorite wildlife researcher. Hop Jumbo, everyone. Jumbo, we're at Safi River, heading oh, north to Savannah. If you have any wildlife <laughs> spotting tips, we'd love to hear them. Over. Roger, Simba one. We'll do. Over. Here at Safi River, keep your eyes peeled for any hippos in the water. You gotta look for hippos. Jeff. Now hippos will spend the majority of the daytime they in the water. There. Otherwise, those big bodies of theirs will really oh, overheat, hey. as they do not have any sweat glands. Ah. There are a few hippos. Now hippos can spend five to eight minutes under the water. And at night, they'll leave the riverbed to eat grass. They can eat 150 pounds in one sitting. They could eat me! They could. <laughs> now, island and, uh, now on the island and along the river's edge are pink back pelicans. Pink back pelicans live in trees and call pink, uh, I'm sorry, those are yellow billed ducks and red pintail ducks, which are only found in Africa. Sorry about that, folks. <laughs> Simba one, when you come to Senecali Bridge, go pole pole very slowly. That old bridge has seen better days, and I think our shifty eyed friends, the crocodiles, know it. Roger Wilson, oh, yeah. we see the crocs oh. and they see us. Those are Nile crocodiles, much Jake. larger than American alligators. Jake. They can go as long as 20 feet. Mommy, look! They may be smiling, but they're not happy to see us. Well, let's oh. get out of here. Oh. 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 What do you think, Maggie? Coming up is one of the best views in the whole reserve. There were African crocodiles. Also up ahead is one of the reserve's finest ancient baobab trees. 